What's going on everybody? It's a boy KB and welcome back. Today I'm gonna show you how to record game sound plus mic in your Android phone. So this tutorial is like a little bit complicated because there are a few things required. First thing, you will need a PC. Second thing, on your PC Windows 10 is required. If you are using Windows 7 or Windows 8 or Windows XP, then this is the useless tutorial. And second thing, obviously the Android phone, good, like decent kind of Android phone, like which supports a specific feature. We'll talk about that later. So computer, Windows 10 installed. If you have that, let's go and an Android phone. Don't forget about the Android phone. So you may have seen that I have done some gameplays and I record the internal sound of the game and my mic. So th this is how I do it, okay? This is actually my personal tutorial. How do I record my Android gameplay sound plus my mic? So let's first, we need to configure a few things in our PC, Windows 10 only. So if you have a Windows 10, let's go. So in the Windows 10, you have to go to the notification panel, open it. And on the notification panel, you'll see there is a one toggle which says connect. We just have to click on it. And once we click on the connect option, we will see projecting to this PC option. We have to click on it and it will open the new settings. And here, this is the setting we have to do inside the Windows 10. So we can project our Android phone and record the gameplay with the sound. So it works just fine. This is the way I record because I have like pretty old phone. In my phone, I can't record my internal gameplay sound. So that's why I use this method to record my Android gameplay if I'm recording any gameplay. So once you're inside the settings, go and default, it will be always up. As you can see, some Windows and Android devices can project to this, this PC when you say it's okay. So we just have to available it like we can enable available everywhere we can available everywhere on secure networks so it's up to you how you want to enable it so i set it as a available everywhere select that and after that ask to project to this pc whenever you're trying to connect to the windows 10 you're trying to project your android phone to the windows 10 what do you want to do ask just one time or ask every time when the connection is requested. So I set it to ask every time. Okay, I'm just gonna select the second option and after that we, you can also set the pin if you want to, but I don't do that. That's it, that's all we have to do in the Windows settings. Now look at these settings closely. So this is what you have to do. And next step is go to your Android phone. On your Android phone, you have to open your notification panel like that. And here you have to find an option called screen mirroring. Like for example, right here, you can see here screen mirroring option. It is here, so I can just click on it. Let me show you one more time. This is the option what I have, screen mirroring. In most of the devices, it might be as a cast. The real name of this setting is cast, C-A-S-T. Maybe in your device, this feature is as a cast. So some devices may have like smart screen and in some devices uh, this cast option is also as a smart screen. So in my case it is screen mirroring and maybe in your case it could be uh, cast. And if you don't see here you can go into the setting and search here cast. Search for cast. I don't have a cast option. Okay. Maybe I have a screen mirroring. Screen mirroring option as you can see i have screen mirroring if screen mirroring is not available search for smart screen okay if this is not available that means your phone your device doesn't support the cast option so that means this tutorial is useless for you now if you don't have these options it won't work okay but if you find the cast option or screen mirroring option in your phone then you are good to go now pull down your notification panel again and click on the screen mirroring and look at my Windows PC now. So when you enable the screen mirroring, you will see screen mirroring available devices. So this is my PC Windows 10. Now if I click on it, 
it will cast my screen to the Windows 10 and it will also cast my audio so let me show you I'm just gonna click on it and look at my PC hit there as you can see I got the notification allow phone to project here so I'm just gonna click on yes and as you can see phone my Galaxy Note 4 is about to project as you can see as you can see here I'm gonna stop recording now my phone is successfully projected to my PC as you can see here right here as you can see I can resize it so whenever you cast your Android phone to your Windows 10 it will open the application called connect there, this is the place where your phone gets projected now final thing we need to test is game sound plus mic so second thing you'll need a any program which records your screen so for example if you have ever recorded your computer screen then you may have heard about the OBS so this is the screen capturing software you can use any software that you want so I just use the OBS software as you can see it is recording my computer if you don't know how to record your computer screen then you can go on to the Google or YouTube and search for how to record my computer's screen and you'll find more information about this so this is the thing you need to know you have to use your computer to record your android phone so to record a computer you need a software any software doesn't matter i recommend obs because it's free and once you have set up your obs and everything now you can just click on start recording and you can maximize your you know android phones projecting as you can see right there now i'm gonna just play i'm just gonna show you one game okay quickly as you can see here and you'll see that you'll hear a in-game sound plus my mic because i'm recording my game using the as you can see wait a second you didn't hear anything because i had turned off my you know <laughs> music all the way down so as you can see now you can hear me and you can also hear the game sound so I'm just gonna click on it and let me do a small gameplay. So this is a heads up gameplay. I mean Android game, okay? <laughs> and you'll see, you can hear the game sound, okay? And uh, this game, game is amazing as hell. Okay, so that's how I record my gameplay if I need to, because you know, without the uh, game sound it's kind of useless to record a gameplay so this is how I do it I'm just gonna disconnect it and I need to show you a few more things I mean I need to tell you a few more things if you go here and go to the pro connect and projecting to this PC if you don't see this setting that means your computer doesn't support the cast option I mean it, it doesn't allow other devices to project to your PC so that means you need a better PC some old PC or laptop doesn't support this option so and this option is only available in Windows 10 so if you have Windows 7 or 8 it will not work even if you have a good PC it will not work because this option is only available in Windows 10 set it twice and that's all you have to know and that's how you record your Android gameplay with the mic plus sound and that's how I do it usually if I need to record any gameplay of my Android phones you know so that's it hope you enjoyed it I will put link in the description for the Windows 10 ISO file so you can install the Windows 10 if you don't have a Windows 10 it's free the ISO file for the Windows 10 is free you can just visit the link in the description and you will get the Windows 10 ISO file and install it and project your Android phone to your PC and record on your PC with gameplay sound plus your mic. And that's it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.